Hey guys, Jen here from Craft Penguin Planner. Welcome to my channel. Today we are planning the week of June 12th through the 18th in my Panici. And we're using the Soar Kit from my shop. So I pulled out this sheet from the, um, the Hobonichi Panici. But I also whoops, pulled out the washi sheet from the full kit. Because I like to use these here and cut them down. And so... That's what we're going to do. I guess let's start with the date. What did I say it was? Today is the 13th, I believe. Yeah. So the 12th is where we start. It is Tuesday evening. I'm filming this. Um, you'll, if you watch it when it goes up, you'll see it the day I'm filming it. Um, but and staying kind of busy as always I mean what else is new um, yesterday I had uh, my friend's daughter I watched for several hours the good portion of the afternoon um, she got out half day from school it was their last day and, um, their after school or whatever thing that they were starting for the summer program kind of stuff didn't start till today. So they didn't really have another option, um, for anybody to watch her until, you know, they got off work. So it's all good. I rearranged some things over the weekend because I had planned to be in the office more yesterday. And so I did that Sunday evening instead and then kind of rotated out. I'm just going to try to do this. Sometimes I know, I wonder if anybody of you wonder what I, um, why I do this, but it's because of the because it's more designed for the Hobonichi. The Panichi has the extra gray lines in there. Sometimes I do this just so that way I can try to make it more even. And, you know, center them a little bit. Because it's not perfect in here. But it's very, very close. So, yeah. Um, in case you're wondering. Why I sometimes, like, jump when I do these. Is to try to space it a little better. Um, but anyways, um. Yeah, yesterday, it ended up working out probably better than it would have if I did it the way I planned, where I was in the office, where I'd have been in the office more yesterday, because I got a whole lot, and I mean a whole lot, designed yesterday. I was really, really surprised um, with how much I got done. Um, she was a little more quiet than she is sometimes when she comes over. She, but she also had her tablet and her mom's switch. So, you know, she had electronics she could play with. So, um, she didn't even ask me to change anything on the TV. She wasn't even paying attention to it. I had homework on anyways. It's not like it was you know, anything inappropriate. So, it was rather nice. I, um, you know, she talked to me when she felt like talking and she was busy on the, on her game. I think she was playing Minecraft mostly, actually. Um, and, you know, she had fun. And, uh, I got a lot of work done. It was very, very productive. Um, so I cannot complain. I'm like, I'm going to put that here, but I'm going to need that in a minute. Um, I can't complain one little bit. But before I could do all that, I actually needed to, um... 
make a run to the post office because I did all the swaps for the pink planner sale. That's all those freebies you get in the freebie bags. Yeah. Um, I took time Sunday night, which I was going to do yesterday, to cut all of that and get all of them shipped out. So I ran to the post office in the morning, then ran to Food Lion so I could pick up a couple of groceries that I needed. I only needed a few things, so and Food Lion's around the corner from my house. So it just is, you know, convenient. So I did that real quick before um, she got here and then worked. And as soon as she left, well, I wouldn't say as soon as she left, but shortly after she left, I dozed off for like 15, 20 minutes, which for me, that's all I really ever need for a nap. Um, because I was up early yesterday too because of the Pink Planner Sale Instagram loop that started at 9 a.m. And if you know me, you know I'm not even out of bed then usually. So, yeah. Um, something is crooked unless it's just the way the page is cut, which is very possible too. Which, I'm not going to let it bother me because, I mean, it's all handmade, so... There's that, but, um, but yeah, anyways, I, um, I was saying I was up early because of that. I, I lost my train of thought, guys. That's all I'm going to use off of that sheet for now. I'll save that for when I use this kit in another planner. Um, I think I got a little bubble there. Didn't lay down straight. Maybe that's what it was. I didn't lay down straight 100% and there's a little bubble right there. I'm just trying to make it smooth. All right. Um, let's see. Oh yeah. oh yeah, after she left, I, I dozed off. And that's about usually all I need is about a 15 to 20 minute nap. If I take a nap any longer than that, then I, I'm like really groggy waking up as if I just got up in the morning and I need caffeine and all that to get going. And it, it's just like, eh. So a 15, 20 minute nap is all I need generally to feel a little bit better. And um, that was enough to get me through the rest of the day. Um, I then got a good night's sleep last night. Got up around normal time today. And today I just, I had allergy shots. Um, oh, yeah. I forgot to take that sticker out. My allergy shot sticker. Of course I did, because it wouldn't be a plan with me without me forgetting to take something out. I feel like I always forget to grab something. Let me grab that album really fast. There. Um, then I can have that sheet nearby. So I can use it when I need it. Um... Yeah, so I went and got allergy shots. I went to Walgreens because there was a couple of things that I needed that happened to be on sale this week. And coupons. I mean, you can't beat that when there's coupons plus a sale. You know. Well, that and sometimes the Ibotta rebates and whatnot. It's just awesome when they all stack like that and you can get a really, really good deal. Anyway, so, uh, I did that today. Um. Oh, yeah, I got gas in the car today, too. I'm like, there was something else I did while I was out. And what was it? Yeah, that's what it was. I got gas. So, not, not exciting, but I got things done earlier today. Um. Started working on some more design stuff. Um, well, 
and didn't just start. I did like. So I recently, because I was asked to, or I, I don't know if I was asked or more forced, but we're going to go with asked. Um, because she did ask me before she placed the order, but sometimes went, um, well, not even just sometimes. I usually will tell you if there's a, a sticker on a sheet that you want a full sheet of. Um, like, say I have a mixed sheet of, um, we'll go with characters because that's just a classic thing. But although I do have individual character listings. So let, let's say a deco sheet. Let's say I have a sheet of deco stickers and you just want a specific one on that sheet or my mixed up foil icon sheet or something like that. And I don't have a sheet of just that item by itself, but you want just that one sticker off of it. I'll usually tell you, order the sheet and leave me a note. Just drop a note requesting a full sheet of just that one and I'll do it for you. I have no problems with that. I do it all the time, literally. And I say that all the time too, but it's true. I do that all the time for people. Well, um, one of my amazing PRs um, asked about, cause she loves my boxes. I have the like big sheets of the half boxes, quarter boxes, even more recently, the square boxes that fit in the academic type planners. Um, these are from Plan with Peggy Co. Tweezers are from Perfect Prince Co. Before I forget to say all that. She wanted each of the colors on sheets of their own instead of a mixed sheet of, you know, instead of like the five sheets that have like the 50 colors or whatever it is. I, I know like the quarter boxes, there were like 50 colors and the squares, I think they were like 30, something like that. But she wanted sheets of each single shade of those colors on their own. And I'm like, well, Right now, the only way you can do it is to do what I always tell you to do and request, you know, order it the way it is and just request them. Oh, she did. She sure did. So I did all of that for her. She got those, but she did the quarter boxes and the square boxes. Well, I'm like, well, if these are from Plan Your Spoons, all of these trackers. Um, I'm going to go ahead and use this one to get it off the sheet here. Um, let's use a pink. And let's use a blue. Just because. Um, so I'm like, if I'm going to do it with one set of them, I may as well do it with all of them. It's going to take time. It's not going to be something... I get to all at once because it is a massive undertaking, but I went ahead today and did the half boxes the to match the quarter boxes and the square boxes. So at least that whole set of the standard type ones will be done and ready for the BBD sale that starts in, you know, three days. Um, what color do I want to use? These are from Lisa Lorraine Plans. I'm looking at, I mean, this has like a lot of different colors on it. Let's, let's just go with the green again, because why not? Um, I still have to do the scalloped half and quarter boxes, but we will get there. Those won't be done yet. But this is still a lot of work. These and these are both from Itty Bitty Sticker Co. This is from Paper Boys and Berry Pie. I'm gonna, I'm holding on to that last penguin. I'm gonna use these. It's from um, 
Inspire Ever After. One of these from Beyond Paper Flowers. All right, we're going to pause with the sticker in my hand because we're going to put all these down. But um, this is to track my how many Cokes I have in a day. It's Coke Zero, but, you know. That kind of correlates with my fatigue and how tired I am, too. Because if I have more energy, then I'm going to drink less caffeine. But, um, over here we need these from Jackie. My workout one. Um, let's hold off on that because we got Pretty Kitty. Pretty is from Pretty Planner. Sleep. Let's use the blue. I don't need. We'll get back to that. Oh, and hydration. Guys, I'm out of my little um cups from Cheerful Planner Girl. So we're going to use this character right here for now um, because I have it until I order some more and get more in. We'll just use what I've got. So um, I was saying something. I lost what I was saying. I hate when that happens. And why am I being forgetful again? I don't know. Anyways. So. Oh gosh, I really did lose it. What was I saying? I'll have to watch this back after and go and find out what I was saying that I seem to have lost so well, and at least I hope I finished a complete thought, mostly. Anyways, well, it is what it is. So this will be my hydration and my sleep. Alright, um, over here. Now we need these. These are from Cheerful Planner Girl. I may have to, I have to look. I may need to... Be ready to order some more of these, too. I think I still have another sheet or so. Because I like to stock up on these. So, we're just going to mix a few colors around here. But. Oh, yeah. I was talking about the boxes. So, I finished those. And the scallop boxes will be another time because I just I need time to do all that is a lot of sheets that's the other thing it's gonna take a lot of time to print and cut and photograph it's a big undertaking so but yeah so I did that. I created some other new functional sheets that have like, I don't know, like 11 sheets a piece for those. Because again, they're multicolored. And yeah. You know, we have the reds, the oranges, the yellows, the greens, the blues. I also have teals, the purples, the pinks. And kind of the neutrals, browns, grays, and blacks. So, you know. That was another big thing. So I'm going to have quite a few releases already for um, Thursday. Which is going to be fun because I have Food Bank on Thursday. And um, that's when I need to get releases up. So I'm thinking... Whatever I finish today for releases is going to be it. This is from Beyond Paper Flowers. Um, because I'm going to have to start printing and cutting and all the stuff tomorrow. Because 
Thursday. I'm not going to have enough time to get everything up um, early enough with me having food bank and all that. So, and, and I mean, I know how much I have. I have a lot ready to go. Oh, look, I still forgot. Um, I need to put down that I got my allergy shot. We can use this one. I got this today. Last week I had doctor's appointments. I think I told you about that in my other videos. Um, here, here's a quick sneak of something that's coming this week is these anxiety trackers. I have never had anxiety until more recently and I am finding that I am, some of the symptoms I'm experiencing lately are just that, it's anxiety. And where it's coming from, I don't know. So I decided to go ahead and make these in both a daily and a weekly type tracker. So I can try to pinpoint stuff. I don't know if I'm going to be able to. Like this morning I was just working on orders and I started feeling it coming on. And I'm like, why? I'm doing the normal things that I do all the time. It, it doesn't make sense to me, but I'm going to see what... I can do if I can narrow it down to what's, you know, triggering it and I keep an eye on it. And so when I see my doctor next, if it's still a recurring issue, I will definitely talk to him because, you know, I get it. So, yeah, these are coming and they'll be in a couple of different colorways too. So, I probably need to make these a smaller version, too, so that way I can actually put them in here. Because that would be something that would be good in here. So, that's probably what I need to work on tonight. But, anyways, I'm going to get off of here. Um, because I still have yet to go make dinner, and it's, um, you know, right about 7 o'clock at this point. So, while this uploads, I'm going to go cook, and I'm going to go eat. And, um, yeah, I hope you guys have a good night. Have a good rest of your week. The sale will be live on Friday. So, um, be on the lookout on my Facebook, Instagram, and all that for the code. And we'll chat soon. Hope you guys enjoyed this. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe. And I'll see you next time. Bye, guys.